question is, should I meditate? And the answer is, no, you shouldn't meditate. Simple as that. It's really not complicated at all. When you say should, expectation is involved. So that means that if you don't do it perfectly, you failed. If you do it perfectly, you've achieved something very great. Both makes you feel imbalanced though. So there's no reason for you to say, should. Should I meditate? Should I meditate 20 minutes? Should I meditate 30 minutes? When should I meditate? In the morning? Should, should, should. Don't. If you feel like you should, then don't. Because it's going to be fruitless. Allow the lives of those who have chosen to, to inspire you. To say, I want to live from the same place that they're living from. Only from inspiration is meditation going to be fruitful. But anything else, it's going to be fruitless. I always thought that I should meditate. Looking at people and Seeing those men who I look up to, seeing the way they were, I was like, I should do this. To the point where I would even freak out at times where I wasn't doing it. Oh man, I didn't meditate this one and oh, the rest of my day is going to be like this. I would feel like this because I feel that I'm in a rush. I should be doing something. I should be meditating. I'm not okay. I should do something about this. Pressure, pressure, stress. Then I started to go, why do I always feel like I'm frustrated about this? What do I always feel like if I'm not doing it? then I'm not okay. And I started to see that I just am always feeling really, really great from meditation or feeling really, really down like my thoughts are destroying me. And in that consistency, I went, this is not helping. It's not. Because I'm doing more meditation, but I'm also feeling attached to the high moments and feeling like I'm trying to avoid the moments where my mind's going to race again. What can I do, though? Remove should. Because if should is in the situation, if it's in the equation, it means that stress is present. 
I'm going to tell you, remove should. Meditate simply because you want to and you know that through the inspiration of looking at someone who's been doing it and the quality of their lives, through that inspiration, you want to do it. Allow their lives to inspire you, but anything else outside of that, get rid of it. Don't meditate because you feel like you should do it. It will be fruitless. You'll just be doing it because you feel like it's going to make you something that you're not right now. Not that it's going to reveal something to you that you already are, but it's going to make you something. Should you meditate? No. From the place of choice, though, yes. Do you want to meditate? <clears throat> That's the best question to ask yourself. Do I want to meditate? I want to meditate because I see the quality of life that someone else can live from this because I see it firsthand. And I'm inspired by that. There's a part of me that wants to live a certain quality of life. And I want to go that way. That is a great way to do it. Simply. I thank you for being here. And I have three spots left in my London seminar. If you feel like you want to learn more about yourself, that which you are, meditation, this is for you. You can go to my website to learn more about that. It's in the YouTube thumbnail, theessenceofman.com. Or you can click the link below in the description box that says London Seminar Tickets and Info. In the meantime, subscribe and share. This is the way that this is going to be able to spread and also for you to be able to know when my videos are coming out. It's more important to be that which you are than to try to become that which you want. So never try, simply be. I'll talk to you tomorrow.